Going to get her going on the defensive end. That's going to get her more minutes from Dawn Staley. Well, I like Dawn using this opportunity. I want to test for Wiley. I want to test Raven Johnson in a fourth quarter. It was some other folks in the fourth quarter of Carolina the other day. The other North Carolina and South Carolina. Bree Hall. She and Kitts made some clutch buckets in Chapel Hill. Final minute and a half. Duke's got to hurry. Good rim run. Donovan. South Carolina looking to stay unbeaten, stay atop the rankings. Oh, nice. Beautiful. Hits. Defender. Not paying it, not seeing the ball. How about, minute, how about this, Beth? South Carolina tested on Tobacco Road. The number one team in the country is checking off boxes as they go because they're getting more resolve and a little bit sharper in every area of the game. You can see them next Sunday as well when they take on Utah in the Basketball Hall of Fame Showcase up in Connecticut. We just don't know who it's going to be on any given night for the Gamecocks. That's how deep they are and how talented this team is. Hall with the exclamation point. The young Blue Devils gave him a fight, though. Big finish in the fourth quarter for the Gamecocks. As they improve to 7 and 0, oh, and an impressive run on Tobacco Road. 77 61 is your final as we tip off the Jimmy V Women's Classic, the first game of our triple header. Coming up next, UConn and Texas. For Debbie Antonelli, I'm Beth Mullins. Good afternoon from Durham. Now let's get you back to the studio with L. Stanton.